Sup fans, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another Will Me reviewing a selected J horror films. And today we'll be talking about, in a spoiler free review and hopefully quick, Carved the Slit Mouth Woman. Coming up right now, you guys enjoy the show. All right guys, quiet on set. Scene one, take one. Action. Boom. Now, if you guys like this video, be sure you guys leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure you share your friends. Also, hit that bell for notifications because it helps us a lot. Car of the Slit Mouth Woman. It is directed by Koji Shiraishi, and it stars Saori Yabe, Shun Shuntaro Kanai, and Hirokazu Ko Kogo. <laughs> Just name a few. Kokago, sorry. Hirokazu Hirokazu Kakogo. <laughs> Now the story is that a bull, basically a spirit that, that looks like a woman who has scissors, that has a face mask on her face, is slowly kidnapping children. Not, not a lot of people know about this, but a lot of children have been found missing. And well, there's a school teacher and another school teacher basically <laughs> try to figure out where this is coming from. And one of the, the male school teacher basically tries to, well, he's very sus throughout the whole movie, but he knows something that a lot of people don't. So they're trying to find a way to stop the Kuchisake Ona to, well, to stop, you know, finding and <laughs> murdering kids and stealing them. So that's my quick and sloppy plot synopsis of the film. Let's, so let's get on to the review. Honestly, this film, I really dug it. I really do dug it. I really think it's an, I, barely, I, I mean, there are some things that are, I can critique about, but then again, honestly, I don't, I'm not going to really do that because they're just mostly like uh, things that I don't really uh, dive into. But honestly, this was surprising. I really dug this film. Overall, the cinematography is pretty good. The acting is still pretty good. And the actress that plays Kuchisake Ona is really creepy. And if you guys don't know the story of Kuchisake Ona, it's basically is a woman that I think cheated on her man and her man found out and he like carved her a smile from ear to ear. And basically the legend is if you catch her on the streets, whatever, by yourself, she'll ask you, am I pretty? If you say yes, she'll take off the mask. And of course, you're going to see her gaping mouth. And she'll ask you again that, oh, am I pretty now? And you, if you say no, she'll kill you. If you say yes, she'll carve a smile on your face. But then again, I heard that if you throw candy or you say you're so-so, that'll confuse her. And enough it, there's a good enough chance for you to run away but then again the urban this film kind of because i believe the story takes place back in the day in feudal japan here set in more modern time well not the 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 sto overall story well the story yeah but the legend like i heard her like when she was a human it happened in feudal japan and here they kind of made it modern time so they took some liberties here just to make i don't know a couple of connections and stuff like that to certain people i'm not going to give anything away but still that's yeah <laughs> but yeah overall the performance is, performance is great I also like the theme and the message about you need to stop neglecting and basically you know take good better care of your kids and all that stuff through bad or through good or bad it's i like that a lot i like that whole message and theme and motif about it about parenting and all that stuff and abuse towards children and yeah there's a couple of gory scenes one thing that i'm so squeamish to look at is a scene with a little girl i'm not gonna say what happens but there's a gory scene and ooh, it's creepy but yeah uh, i think i already talked about the performances but still uh, going back to them the performances are great the teachers are great and also the one of the teachers i believe or she's yeah one of the teachers she also i believe has a she's i think she's yeah she's divorced and she has a little girl of her own and yeah it's crazy it's just just think of all the anxiety and pressure and stress on just there's this person out there taking away kids and who knows if your kid is next because that shit is creepy the score is as eh, pretty okay and yeah overall the acting is very good and the story is actually in my opinion is pretty nice it's it's a nice little story it's a simple story where they try to figure out the how to again how to stop this curse or the the spirit of kuchi sakaona but still it's it's you know it's pretty good and the makeup effects are great and overall it's, it's i think it's a fun movie it actually feels a closer to a classic j horror film in my opinion there's a lot of quiet moments and when there's scary moments it catches you off guard and it just builds and also builds up to it and i like that a lot so basically kuchisake ona is a surprise to me it feels like a nice little for me though at least a slightly nice little comeback to classic j horror films or j horror in general and honestly i still dug it it's very enjoyable i, I highly recommend it. i think it's still on youtube if not then sorry i don't know where else to find it but uh overall carve the slip mouth woman it's still a lot of fun performances are great and all that stuff and yeah i already said that but still it's great and mainly the performances in my opinion are the ones that steal everything and the story and once if like if the performances are great you in my opinion you get invested or i get invested in the story with the characters so yeah <laughs> yeah 
one last thing I say, it's a surprise to me. <laughs> so if I were to give the film a rating, I'll give it a four out of five. I still think it's a solid film. Not perfect, but still, I think still think it's a solid film. So that is my quick and spoiler review on Car of the Slit Mouth Woman. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And thank you guys so much for watching my video. So let me know down in the comments down below. Have you guys seen Car of the Slit Mouth Woman or Kucha Sakeona? Please let me know down in the comments down below. I'd like to hear your opinions on it. So this is Hobby from Hobby Productions signing off and hope you guys enjoyed the show.